Hold up. Wait, wait a minute. Now, this wig don't look nothing like that girl got on. I bought the same wig. I clicked on the same link. This wig look like somebody's grandma. They got hair sticking out. Hold up. Let me let me go back on her video because I know I bought the same wig that she reviewed. I'm looking at her information right here. She bought free trust equal wig in a color number two. Okay. I went to the same exact site. This don't look like what she got on. This wig don't look nothing like what that girl reviewed on her video. But Jesus, if I catch her, I'm a beater. How many times does this happen to you ladies? You watch a YouTuber's video and the wig look absolutely awesome on them. You purchase the same wig, sometimes you even purchase the same color, and the wig looks nothing like they have on. It can be fixed. So I'm going to show you certain things that you can do to get your wig to look, you know, from a hot mess to somewhat acceptable. And yes, I did buy this wig on purpose because this was one of the wigs that was sitting there that looked kind of like my grandma would wear it. So that's the whole point of this video. If you get a terrible looking wig, but some of the dead giveaways for your wig looking really wiggy are the sideburns and the back. On this wig, the back of the wig do look, it looks nice. The wig right there looks okay, but if your wig um, didn't look as tapered, you would need to trim around the back to make your wig look a little bit more, you know, done. The sideburns are a dead giveaway for your wig looking wiggy. Look at this. Nothing about it looks natural. They are too long and it just doesn't look natural so we are going to go ahead and trim those you're going to take your scissors and you're going to angle it downwards okay cut a little bit comb it out from this to this I'm trying to make this user friendly so that everyone don't have a clippers or this. So we're going to use what most people have. Most people have a razor comb. You're going to go through and you're just going to make the sides a little bit more tapered. Now we need to address all this, all right? The hair sticking out, you can just bring that down with mousse or water. I'm gonna use water. Use the water to train the hair in the direction you want it to go.
final look of course it's nothing really drastic but it did make a bit of a difference than the initial wig so I'm gonna turn around give you the whole entire look so a few minor changes and the wig looks a lot better a lot more wearable it looks like something out of a salon instead of out of a bag. Hope this helped you guys to, you know, dress up your wig a little bit to make it look less wiggy and more wearable. Thanks again for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share my videos. And don't forget to hit that bell for future videos to come. And I will see you guys soon. Bye-bye.